Welcome to the Crazy Town Podcast. I'm Jonas. I'm TNT Dynamite the Explosive One. Uh, let's crack it to another one. TNT. Yo. So, in uh, Kentucky, yeah. Kentucky, Florida, there was a <laughs> a judge that was murdered. Okay. That, that's not good. No. That's it's a def- terrible state of affairs. Yeah. Uh, he was murdered in his chambers at the courthouse. What the hell? How some, what, do you have assassins in the courtroom? The person who murdered him was the sheriff of the town. Not the deputies, the actual head of the department, the sheriff. Not the, not the deputies. <laughs> I get it. I like that. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it's, it's, a, it's a song. Um... That's it's, why did the sheriff it's, kill him? Though it said that, uh, like, the, what was his reason? The sheriff Sean Steins, forty three, uh-huh. whose role made him responsible for the judge's personal security. Crazy, shot him after an argument inside the chambers. It says he's facing first degree murder charges, and he said uh, he turned himself in without incident after that happened. And they're still investigating, like, what the argument was about. Yeah. It's got to be something crazy if you're shooting me over, if I'm like, what? Do you think it was over a woman? (laughs) Like, how did you know that's what I was going to say? Because, you know, it it, it usually is. I mean, it usually is. Either, like, my my thought, I mean, this is all conjecture, okay? Like, this is not, here's where the, the truth, not facts ends. I'm like, I'm thinking he either owed him money. For something, it, he was like they were. It was a woman, or he one of them had sex with the other one's wife, or they were having sex with each other, or they had a relationship together. One of them wanted to come out. Like I cannot think of another reason, like that you would like shoot a man after just having an argument with him, unless it had to do with having sex with someone, having sex with each other, or money. Those are the only things, and and like I hate to say that it's usually over a woman because I feel like most of the animosity that guys have for each other. You put two guys in a room, you put fifty guys in a room. We're gonna build like something in the dirt together, like no animosity. <laughs> but if you put fifty guys in a room and one woman, someone's gonna get end up murdered. That's when the posturing starts, and like, oh, oh dude, you can't pick that up. That's when all of that starts. Uh, dude, you can't pick that up. Like, oh, I'll pick up this rock. You can't pick up that rock? Dude, I don't know. That That's just, like, kind of insane to me. That, here's the thing. You're the sheriff, bro. You don't have enough control of your goddamn weapon to not murder a judge? I don't, like, I don't understand why you would do it. In the chambers, like he obviously just like snapped. He has he obviously lost his mind about something, and yeah. I cannot think of much that would have cost. Like you know, like we talked about, man. Like it's either a heat of passion, you f my wife, yeah, give me my goddamn money, yeah. And like I said, like I said, it was either he effed his wife or they were effing each other. Uh, it kind of reminds me of uh, there was another story about a. Uh, like a transgender model in Georgia, a Carija Abra. Oh, I think I, I, this is a story. I think I heard about this. Yeah. Apparently, uh, she was dating some guy and she was going to, you know, come out about their relationship. And he was like, hell no. Yeah. So and he was he having sex him. with a trans woman mm-hmm. and they were, they were all fine with it. But then when she wanted to tell people about it, he murdered her. Insane. You know? You're like obviously you you're attracted. You have some sort of feelings for this person, and you'd rather just murder them That's than people insane. know that you are in love with a trans woman. Like, is, is it really? Look, man, it ain't that bad being gay. Like, it's not like I got to do prison time being gay, and now everybody knows that you're gay. So, like, I just like everyone found out anyway, so you it's... might as well keep the relationship and have sex with them. I that's... know. I don't know why. What's the uh, football player that did it? Did what? The same, basically the same shit. Murder somebody? Who's Anthony, gay? Her- Anthony Hernandez? Oh, Aaron Hernandez. Aaron Hernandez. No, he didn't. It wasn't because he was gay. <laughs> 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 well, there's rumors that he was gay, but he was. I don't think it was that he was, he was banging that guy that he killed. 
I think that guy knew some business about him. Him being gay, probably. Yeah, whatever. But, I'm just saying that he. You, some people will go to the grave over that ish. But, like, you're actually out there doing the gay ish. It's crazy to me. I don't understand that. So Yeah. There I'm was just, there was a kid that I know. Like, he ended up dying from, from, like, a medical condition. Like, so, rip. But he was, like, the biggest homophobe I had probably ever met in my life. Like, anyone tried to, if a guy tried to hug him or whatever, he'd be like, get away from me. Ew, uh, uh. And then, turns out, homeboy was gay. It's usually those ones that are that. Yeah, there was another close friend I had in high school. He, he would say dumb-ish about, like, a gay d- dude he worked with making fun of him and stuff. Homeboy ends up gay. Like, usually be the ones. Yeah, like, it's... It's it's that self-loathing overcompensation. It's like, bro, like, no no straight man is that concerned about gay. No. That's real. Is that not the truth? It, you're not wrong. Well, it's, or it's like, um, they say that, like, I'm not, I'm not trying to get political, but they'll say that, like, in very conservative markets... Like some of the biggest porn watching is like transsexuals, Tran, yeah, and they're just yeah. like, I'm just interested in what it is. I didn't lie, so I didn't see what it was about. Like, you're like, bro, it's not the top porn because you like you're into it, it's fine, just be it into is. it. It really is fine. You just go ahead and do it, nobody's gonna say anything. If they do, F them. you make a big deal about it, but no one else cares. Yeah, nobody, <laughs> honestly, that's what it is. It's it's the thing, it's that whole thing in general where people are like, it's like. Where people are like, oh my god, I can't believe that like no one told me my lipstick was on my teeth. Or nobody told me I had like something on my face. And like, nobody notices that shit most of the time. Yeah. Like, yeah. nobody cares about you that much. No, no, nobody cares. You're like, not, not it was, star um, show. somebody told me one time, it was like, you know, if you think people, you know, like, it was like, say you think that like you're, you're fat or whatever, right? Sure. And it's like, go for a walk and, and like, uh, like on a busy street where cars are just driving by, but pay attention to how many people even look your way when they're driving. No one. Nope. No one probably even noticed you were walking down the goddamn street, let alone that you had a belly or like whatever. No one gives a shit. No one gives a shit about you. But our own egos make us think that everyone gives a shit about us, about everything. Yeah. Yeah. In psychology, they, they have a name for that, like the uh, imaginary audience or something. I believe it's what it's referred to as. Um, yeah, it it but it, it plagues a lot of people. They're constantly concerned with like how they look. I think of like all the effed up cars I've ever seen in my life. I've never come back home and be like, dude, I can't believe this car. I, I saw. mean, there's been a couple I've there's, seen. There's have been a couple. Yeah, but yeah. even the ones that I see, like, I mean, I still like I'll just be like, Man, that's an interesting car choice. And then I move on with my life and I never think about it ever right. again. Right. It's not like you're calling up every person, writing your mom a letter, telling her about it's like nobody cares. Exactly. But you know what? That goes for you hot bitches too all right let's keep it a buck i'm not going home talking about how hot this chick was at the mall either so you know tuck it in it's been i've seen a lot of beautiful women in my day and it's very rare that i've ever come home to tell anyone like i saw this really beautiful woman at this thing that i went to i can't say i've never done it i probably have and when i say hot bitches that i'm talking about men too you you hot bitches need to chill out yeah but like i i mean i it the chances of me never coming home and saying to a friend or a roommate or whoever and being like, man, I saw this girl at the mall today that was damn. Yeah. Like, or a hot guy. Oh, yeah. Or, yeah. I mean, damn, I saw this hot bro at the. <laughs> like, but for the Dude, most part. He works out. For the most part, I don't even notice. I'm just like walking around, man. I'm just like, whatever, dude. I mean, so it, it's, not, it's not that important. I hope that it was, uh, you know, at least like maybe he, he killed a villain. Maybe he like died. turns out he's like a child predator or something. Like I'm he's not gonna... putting that on a dead man's jacket, man. I cannot <laughs> do that. Jonas jump out the window with the allegations, just sprinkling allegedly's on just everything. Just some crack on him. <laughs> Jesus, man. Like he has some crack inside his cheeks. Look at that. He had crack. He had some crack on him. <laughs> we can get some media Self training. Defense. Gonna... Yeah, <laughs> media <laughs> training. <laughs> like, a PR. I heard the judge with some. Children, I'm like Jesus, man. <laughs> yeah, so, but I don't know, man. That's it's wild though because that's like a prominent like person. Like even if it's like a small town in Kentucky, right, or a small county. I guess every county has a sheriff. I think that's how it works. Prominent person, broad daylight. Like no in way you're the, getting away in with the that. Workplace. No way you're getting away with that. Right. Like you. It was a. It was a heat of the moment thing. And that's where you need to like. I remember when we did the story about the guy that tried to shoot. 
the the guy at the Amazon office. Oh, he stood behind him and just tried to kill yeah. his boss. It's or like, what? what gets a person to that point? That's what I need to know. Yeah, you know? some like, what, right. Either they're not well adjusted, but yeah. like for you to be the sheriff and you're you're responsible for all the law enforcement of that county I mean, plus the judge's security, and you're in there just waving your gun around to him. I'm, Look, as a black person, we've been saying for years. <laughs> we, we've been saying for years that police are low, you know. Anyway. Yeah. <laughs> so, go to thecrazytown.com and subscribe for Jonas. TNT. Oh, yeah.